Hello, I'm William Attlee and this is a news brief with truth. See the men on the screen. They are the ancestors of the African American, but there is a problem. Their true identity. Thomas McNeely has the story. Well, William, the African American community is deeply divided due to the tagline, African Americans ain't Africans, which can be found in numerous places on the web. Now, it should be obvious as to why it's causing a commotion, but if it escapes you, let me explain. The current American education states African Americans were brought to America as slaves from Africa, which is simply not true. They are American indigenous, not descendants of Africans. As they say, the truth is stranger than fiction. Although this fact isn't spoken of openly, it's not a secret. However, with programming such as Roots, 12 Years a Slave, The African American Story, and The Book of Negroes, is it any wonder why so many African Americans are confused? We won't address all the misleading DNA tests being provided to connect African Americans to Africa. So, the argument is, do they continue identifying as African Americans, which is a fake identity for them, or embrace being identified as indigenous Americans. Are there any consequences of choosing one identity over the other? Uh, William, that's a good question. Um, according to African Americans Ain't Africans Facebook forum, identifying as African American is to quietly relinquish ancestral connections to America. Connections that go back hundreds of thousands of years. A curious story, but one appropriate for February, which is Black History Month in the United States. Uh, what's a conundrum? A story worth keeping an eye on for further developments. Thank you, Thomas. The drawing used in this presentation is from the 16th century book, America being the latest and most accurate description of the New World by John Ogilby and Arnoldus Montanus. As you may have guessed, the men in the drawing are American. I'm William Attlee and this has been a news brief with truth.